Welcome to West Country Wanderings and welcome to Somerset. Yes, this is the first time the West Country Wanderings has been in Somerset. We're here at the town of Froome. In fact, we're here at the town's railway station, complete with its Brunel shed. I'll show you a bit of that, more of that in a minute. Now, I originally planned to come to Froome on the train and I'm just going to catch the train down from Gloucestershire, there is a through train you can get to Froome. Um, but I'm also needed to come into Devon and Cornwall, a bit further to the south and the west of here. So I thought, well I'll combine the two together, and instead of going on the M5, I thought I'd come by Froome. So here I am. So I'm going to show you a bit of the uh, shed, and then we'll have a look around the town here in Somerset.
another word of warning that uh, if you do come here, there's a freight train just going through. Yeah, so if you do come to uh, Froome, word of warning that the traffic is quite bad and also it's got some horrendous one-way systems and lots of roundabouts so again the train is probably the best option. The station's about, I think it's about three quarters of a mile outside of the town centre and I think there's fairly frequent service on the Wessex line through Westbury so that might be a good way to do it and also then you get to see that wonderful Brunel railway centre which is pretty unique. Just seen a sign there saying Meadow Walk to the railway station, so you could cut her through that way rather than walking along the busy road into the town centre. It does get quite congested with traffic in the town as well as the roving road. So, yeah, don't come by car. I think that's probably the message if, unless you live very, very local. Um, yeah, so I've enjoyed my time here. Brief visit to Froon. Sadly, I'm running out of daylight now. It's coming up to quarter past four right at the end of November. So you might see this in November, you'll probably actually be landing on my channel in December. Love to hear from you, particularly if you've got any feedback regarding the county of Somerset. It's not a county I know very well at all. Um, as I say, I've been living in a lot of my time in Cornwall. I spent quite a bit of time in Devon and then I've moved back to my county of birth, Gloucestershire. But the bit in the middle, <laughs> Devon and also a bit further to the east, Dorset, I don't know those counties so well, so um, I will be discovering as we go on with the channel more places in those two counties. But uh, if you do know areas that you can recommend in those two counties, I'd love to hear from me. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's tour, brief tour around the town of Froome, West Country Wandering's first foray into the county of Somerset. And hopefully it won't be too long before I'm back in the, the county again. The only difficulty is that uh, it, is, it does take quite some time to get to from, from where I live in Gloucestershire, because you have to kind of get the other side of the Bath, Bath and Bristol conurbations. So it is a little bit tricky from, from that respect, but uh, we will be back here again very soon. So take care of yourselves, look after yourselves, and hope to see you all again soon. Cheers now, bye bye.